back to my channel, Life Plus Style Equals Lifestyle. We're always a lady. All right, you guys. So today we are going to, okay, so I've been getting a lot of inboxes and questions about, because people hear me talk about like booties, 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 booties. And if you know me, if you follow me on my other platforms, you know that I love a booty boot. I will wear a booty boot in the winter fall summer spring i don't care i'm if it works for my style i am going to wear it so today's vlog today's fashion vlog is all about booties that i would wear in the winter some that is trending some that's not trending just overall just booties that you know you should have in your closet and if you want to start to collect certain types of booties to have from season to season i have the perfect ones from me to you and this is me this is my style um what i try to teach a lot is go on your style be having stuff on trend is super great having a trendy shoe super great but at the end of the day everything that trendy doesn't work for you everything that is new um coming out from season to season may not be everything your that's coming trendy may not be your style so what I've learned over time from one, from being a designer, turned stylist, image consultant, I learned that you are who you are through your style. And it's okay to add those pieces, but shop for what makes you happy. If you don't like the new trends that's in, it's nothing wrong with wearing old trends and mixing them with um, vintage and just mixing up your style. It's great for, to be in something that is always like on trend and designer. That's just not for everybody. But that doesn't make you less than. That doesn't make you less stylish. It doesn't make you um, less um, amazing or fabulous. So basically let's talk about my trend my 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 booty boots anyhow so this used to be my linen closet and i was just like so in my condo it's just me and my son um and my roommate and i'm just like we don't really need all of this space so you know i was just like i have a area where my washing machine and dryer is and i have a shelf there so that's where i store like my towels and my sheets because we don't really need a lot it's not a house full of people um and we rotate every you think so often and we wash you know once a week if not twice so we don't need a lot of storage space and i just looked at my lifestyle and said hmm how can I make more room for myself? Uh, because I have to get up every day and get dressed and being able to see what I have is important to me. And what's important to me is necessary because I go out and I work and I pay the bills and I do all of that great stuff. So it has to make sense. So this used to be my linen closet. So what I did is took everything out of the linen closet and I said, I have a lot of booty boots. I'm going to make this my booty boot and boot closet. So here's just a couple of my favorite booties that I wear all season long or, you know, just depending on what I have on, I wear it. Now, it's really hard to really mix some of these in with the summertime, but I do have booties like this that is peep toe and have, um, you can, you're ventful through here. So I wear these during the spring and summer and these are actually shoe dazzle. I got these, ooh, maybe about six years ago or so I, so i got these and i got these so these both are shoe dazzle um booty boots and they they listen they are they are going to be fashionable anytime i wear them and i'm gonna tell you why for one there are two main colors pretty much you got a black and you got a silver and then you have sparkle on them who doesn't love sparkle sparkle never goes out like you can wear sparkle any time of the year i don't care what's trending it's going to always be an eye catcher and what i love about it is you might not find these again no time soon so when i wear them next season or whenever people are going to be like oh my god where did you get those from and i'd be like oh shoe dazzle about six years ago and more than likely i won't see anybody else with them on and you know probably where i'm at now of course people have these because they bought them did they keep them no did they understand what they bought probably not so understanding what you have and when to get rid of it is really important so let's start as fall so these are like kind of my new newest ones these are actually steve madden and i bought these like right maybe a month before summer was out so you see these these are the Steve Matt, and I don't know what they call them, but I will definitely link them below if they still have them. Now, these you'll be able to wear summer, winter, fall, spring. They'll go well with so many things. I'm talking from jeans to pencil skirts, um, flowy skirts, um, 
You can wear these to work. You can wear these with a blazer. You can wear these with a little bit of everything and they are a statement shoe. So they're gonna always, always make heads turn. Like those are gonna be a showstopper no matter how you wear them. These are my babies. These are my love. I need to go and get them shined up and everything. So these are Jennifer Lee boots. These were gifted to me about two and a half years ago um, by a friend of mine for my birthday. Like these are so amazing. These Jennifer Lees are like they, I, I wear these winter, spring, summer, fall. And you see they have the, um like the cow hair on them. Um, Is it a cow or sheep? I don't know. This is genuine leather, patent leather. Like I need to shine them up. But these babies are amazing. I can actually wear these with what I have on right now. Like perfect black with the gold, um, gold metal. You can't beat it. As y'all can see, I added like some different purse inspirations in there because say, hey, if I'm in a hurry and I'm like, hey, I'm going to grab these. I'm probably wearing some jeans. This, I can grab this. I can grab this. I can grab that. I can grab the blue. So when you can see what you have, it makes it easier for you to style yourself. Um, so uh, some other basic ones I have, these are guest ones that I have. And these are a little bit more, not as fancy, but these are more like your combat booty boots. Um, they, they have the platform heel. And what I love about these is they don't have the really big platform heel. So whether your platform is in and out, you can still get away with these because it doesn't have a really big platform where people are like, we're not wearing platforms like that anymore. So I made the choice to back a booty boot like this with a small platform because platform comes in and out every two to three, four years. So you can get away with these for fall and winter, early spring. Um, what's some other ones that I have? Some trusty. So also, so you have the plain black, you have the crystal, you have the, um, these are like the 60, 50, 40s kind of inspiration. But then I also have, you know, a printed one. This is snake skin. And as we know, snake skin comes in and out, in and out. So you can never go wrong with that. This heel is not going to always be on trend, but I guarantee you anytime you wear these, the heels are not going to matter because the boot is going to make a statement itself. Um, and therefore, like I'm saying, when you know how to purchase certain things and why you should purchase them and when, you will have everlasting pieces in your closet that you can wear forever. Um, people, they don't shop with intentions. They go and buy what they see on the shelf and be like, oh, I want this because it's trendy. And then they realize those are one of those things that you're probably just not going to wear again because it's too trendy. Um, and if you look at certain things like the heel, if it's pointed toe, if it's round toe, you know those are going to come back every three to four years. It always does. It never fails. It just comes back maybe in a different color or the colors are different for that season. But, you know, those styles always come back in. Um so also these these are kind of a more of an ankle booty boot and again it has the thick heel small platform but they're a statement boot they're really cute you can wear this with jeans you can wear this with skirt you can pretty much style these with anything in your closet you could dress these up you could dress these down you could put these on with a beautiful um lint dress with those boots out and you can have on a bling necklace and you can just look fabulous on a red carpet with these boots a fancy dress like you can really do some things with this um what's another one that i have as far as booty boots classic like i really love these these are kind of like my favorite these are my oldie but goodies and i got these these i believe these are also shoe dyes too but what i love about them is the color oh my god this color turns heads every time i wear them like people's like oh my god i love your boot no you actually love the color because the boot goes in and out of style you know the pointy i mean the straight um stiletto heel the pointy toe that goes in and out of season but i can rock these anytime and get people to be like oh my god it's the color is that i think this is um like a magenta or something like that so yeah and as y'all can see i have that in a different color so i have that in a green i need to go get these clean turn heads it's the color, not the style. So when you see certain things that you just know that you can mix and match in your wardrobe, like you literally can wear both of those colors with anything. Like you can put on plain jeans, tank top, a blazer, and throw those heels on. Like I could throw those on with what I have on now and people will flip. Like right now I have on yellow um, rain boots because it's raining out. And people are like, oh my God, I love your boots. No, you love the color because it goes well with what I have on. And that's what people, you got to know better to do better. Got to know better to do better. Ow. Okay. Um, again, so what's another one that I have that I love? 
Oh, so we also have these. These have a, a bigger platform than the other ones. It has a um, not as thick of a heel, but not as stiletto. And then it has like a thicker platform. So these are kind of like a trim boot. But again, depends on how you wear them. People won't even notice the platform. They're going to notice the boot because that's what's standing out. So, you know, again, it depends on what you're buying. And these are guests too. Guests have some really cute shoes honestly and they're very comfortable i can do guests for about walking a good three to four hours and not start to feel like oh my god my feet starting to hurt so guests actually has a nice shoe um and nice boots also i have a lot lot of guests so um and then i also have like i have the snake skin again i have um I have these that I haven't even wore yet. And I think these are Jessica Simpson. Yep, these are Jessica Simpsons. Again, the color is going to kill them. I'm going to pop these out these fall with something. It's going to be crazy. Um, what else do I have? Um, I've had these for years. These are some that I wore during the summer. As y'all can see, I done wore them janks out. I need to go get them um, redone at the bottom. But it's the color. Um, the style, this shoe is so old. This shoe is probably like eight years old. But if I wear them next summer, it's going to be the color. They're not going to care about the style. But as y'all can see, I love a booty boot, whether it is an ankle booty boot, a mid, a mid, um, mid leg booty boot, or a thigh booty boot. Like, I love it. Um, and then kind of sort of, when you go from your booty boots, because I'm a boot girl, I just love shoes. Again, I told y'all, shoes is something that I really invest in. Um... I really like my highest pair of boots in here thus far is these ones, the Jennifer Lee's. These were $500. Um, and then next, I probably would say was, um, whew, we haven't even got down to those boots, so I can't even say. So just uh, talking about boots. So I'm going to show you a couple of my thigh high boots. Now, I used to did not like thigh high boots. Anything past like my, my knee, I didn't like it. It was, it, it, to me, it felt a little sluttyish, I want to say. But then I thought about it and I was like, that is so damn judgmental of you. Oh my goodness. But I used to see people wear them and be like, oh, those are so cute. You look so good. I just didn't have the confidence to wear them. Until one day I put some on and I was like, oh, they didn't mess up now, honey. They didn't mess up. Let me put on a thigh high boo. Okay. <laughs> So now I have my newest ones are these. These are my, these I believe are Jessica Simpson. Yep. So these are my Jessica Simpsons. I'm going to pop these janks early fall. I cannot wait. And I think I have an event coming up on October 18th. It is a fashion panel I'm going to be on. I think I'm going to do these style high boots with something mini with some tights under them. Baby. But it depends on how I feel. But these are my recent ones. I bought these actually last winter. Um, and again, I, I do shop a lot of my shoes pre-season. So during fall, I'm going to start looking for my stiletto, me, my um, my heels and my open toes. I don't do a lot of open toe sandals. I really don't like summer shoes anyway because I sweat a lot. But anyhow, um, I actually bought these last winter. I don't know how I'm going to wear these yet, but I believe these. These are INC's. These are uh, Macy's brand, INC. I wore them once. They feel really good on. And you see, they have kind of like the rounded, pointy toe, stiletto heel, but babe, a babe. Who child. I got some places to go, honey. Mm. Um, and again, I'm going to try to find all these boots the best that I can, and I'm going to link them below um, if they're still on sale or if you can still find them. Um... I actually have these red ones. As we know, red is going to be a color for fall. This one has a really small heel. That's why I don't care for them too much. And these are um, Thalia. These are a brand that um, Macy's carry. They're cute, but this will be if I go somewhere like a networking event, chill, probably just wear like some jeans that has a blazer because i really don't like small heels they make me seem not high and i don't like it so these are a pair that i have um also i have these now these are a little bit more comeback ish 
they go like right over my um knee but they have a thicker heel these are guests actually and they have a round toe and these are good for if you're going to be doing a lot of walking um if you're going to be doing some standing because you have support so these are some new ones that i added to to gang gang as my son will say um and then i have these i love these so much what brand is these these are actually it says 70 central i don't know but they're so fucking they're so freaking cute on like i wear these all the time the perfect way for me to wear this and this is just my style is some jeans with a white shirt and i do like a blazer with these the detail in them is what makes them stand out and it's they are so freaking cute and comfortable oh and so those are a few of my booty boots so for everyone that's asking yes i love boots oh i forgot to show you guys these i actually also bought these um this past summer and these are steve madden too definitely gonna wear a lot of these um because my style is kind of simple streamlined i don't do a lot of statement pieces i like like classic look for me it looks good on me it makes me feel good that's what i love sometimes i wear like a statement piece here and there depending but i really like my statement to either be in my shoe my jewelry my handbag really my accessories and i like to keep my clothes like really simple and classic because I can mix and match them so much better for my lifestyle because I do a lot of networking. I do a lot of events with my clients. I have to be, you know, um, in spaces where I need to look professional majority of the time. And then when I do go to like fashion shows, fashion events, things like that, I have to, I have things that I can go to for that or I'll get something new. But I like my, um, I like my clothes to be simple because I can really mix and match them and that works for my lifestyle. Um, so for yo, for those are asking, yes, I am a booty boot girl. Um, I love booties. As you can see, I am adding booties to my collection that I know I can keep from season to season. Um, when I do buy something that's really trendy, more than likely I end up, you know, giving it away or, you know, selling it on like, um, Poshmark or something like that. But these have been in my wardrobe besides the new add-ons like the Steve Maddens that I just got and a couple of those in my wardrobe for years and i'm looking for more as you can see you see a lot of black but you see some pop color you see some print in there and that's because i know that these things are going to come back around every two to three years and instead of me trying to go and reinvest in it i buy ones that i buy now and then i can wear them when they come back out and people are like oh my god where did you get those from oh you're not gonna find these they don't make them anymore um so yes this is my booty collection and my knee-high boot collection. I am study at knowing, um, and I just love them. I fell in love with booties years ago. They make me feel confident. They make me feel good. I love the way they look on my body because the way I am shaped, the way that, you know, how high I am, the way my hips go, how big my breast is, all of that matters when you are buying stuff for you. Like, people don't understand, you just can't wear everything no i mean like really you can't wear everything and when you find something that works for you it's okay to overindulge in it because you know this works for you this looks good on you no matter how you wear it when you wear it you feel amazing that is your thing booty boots is my thing this is my booty boot closet so i know when i have on an outfit and i'm like oh need some booty boots i come straight to my closet makes it so much easier for me to get dressed i can see what i got i can pull it out i can pull it on and i can be moving about and i can be shaking and i can be gone um i wish i had bigger space because i'll you know i can pull it out more put more accessories and handbags and stuff around so i can really see what i have but right now i'm thankful for what i have so yes um this is my booty boot collection i'm very proud of it and it is growing as i grow it's gonna grow it's gonna get more amazing um so yes you guys i'm excited about it so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna make sure i any shoe that's still available i'll drop the link below if you have any questions on how to find what shoe works for you and um how do you know that it's the perfect shoe for you you will know you will know what's your shoe like 
you will see in my closet if you if, as you can see you see what my thing is so if you see my other shoe closet you'd be like yeah you're a heel girl but you like kind of statement heels i like heels with bows on them and colorful and stuff like that i have the basics but i have those that have like that statement thing to it because that's my thing i like my statement to come into my shoes and my handbags as i said before anyhow so yes and um a lot of y'all have been actually ask, actually asking me what foundation do I wear. As you know, I am not a makeup girl. But when I do go out and have stuff to do, um, I have to kind of just make myself look a little bit more crisp and clean. And I've been using the Il Maquillage. Il, Il Maquillage. Yes. And I've been using the um, concealer and this. So I'll link this below also, as y'all can see. So this has been working for me and I'll link my color. As you can see, I kind of look just real balanced here. You, I don't have a whole bunch of that stuff. Couture and I just basically throw some foundation on my face. Make sure I look good and I keep it pushing. Um, my lashes are from the dollar store, just to let you know. Um, and then as y'all can see, I have like my bigger fall purses up here, but you guys, this is the booty boot collection. Again, I am going to link anything that's still available below or anything that is similar to what I have. If you're a booty boot person, reach out to me, say, Hey, Hey, what's up? Show me a boot, kick me a boot, comment me a boot or something like that. Um, <laughs> and then, um, yeah, you guys, so I'm excited to show y'all. I really love my collection. I'm proud of it. It is something that I've been working on for years, and I try to um, keep my stuff as beautiful as possible, but wear and tear happens. Um, but anyhow, okay, you guys, so next video or the one that I'm going to do coming up is going to be my blazers. I have certain things that I invest in, and right now I think I got about 50 blazers, maybe. So I'm going to do a tutorial video on just blazers what blazers you should have in your closet if you don't have any and how to add certain blazers to your closet as you, as you go because you should always start with your basics and then move on into maybe a trendy blazer and something a statement or something like that and this one is this is a this is a dky i do believe hold on no this is actually a calvin klein and this one's been in my collection for a while and as you can see i have one all black threw it on have on my boots because it's raining, simple accessories. And when I tell you, I've had so many people say, oh my God, you're so cute today. That's so cute. I actually had them on with these boots today. So I had this on with these boots and then it started raining. So I had to come home and change it, go to the grocery store, all that good stuff, whatever. So in the fact that I can go from one shoe to the next and I still look stylish, I still look amazing because I know my style. I shot with intentions. I know how to buy stuff for me. Not what everybody else got on, not what the mannequin got on, no. So, um, thank you guys for watching. Thank y'all for uh, chiming in on this video. If you would like more videos like this one, talking about just different pieces in your closet, what you should have and shouldn't have, definitely go ahead and like and subscribe. Turn on the notification button, whichever way it is. And make sure you uh, get notification for every time I drop a video. I would love for you guys to join the Life Plus Style equals Lifestyle because everything that you do with, with your style, whether it is your car, your home, or your fashion, that is your lifestyle. And you want to do it the best you can with all the intentions that works for your lifestyle. So thank you guys again for watching. This is my booty boot collection. I'm so happy and proud of it. I just love it. So sometimes I leave the door open so I can just stare at it. Anyhow, remember, if you can't see what you have, how are you supposed to wear it? Remember, always dress to what makes you feel good, what makes you feel happy. Never make yourself feel any less than you should feel because you can't afford certain things. Everything has a way of, of being able to be for you. If you need tips, if you need ways to learn how to shop with intentions, how to shop in your budget, where you should shop, the things you should do, how you should start adding to your wardrobe, I'm your girl. Y'all go ahead and like, subscribe, and I will see y'all on the next vlog, whichever one that is. Mm -hmm.